uh, Mr. Bipin Tiwari, hearty congratulations on securing Alina rank 7 in mechanical engineering branch in the recent uh, GATE 2022 examination. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, Mr. Tiwari, you tell us yes, what type of coaching program you have availed from our ACE Engineering Academy. Sir, I was a student of test series, ACE Academy test series. So you have taken test series from ACE Academy. Yes. Sir. Okay, Mr. Tiwari, tell us uh, how ACE Academy test series helped you in your gate preparation and securing this such a good rank in gate examination. Yes, sir. So actually, test series plays a very vital role, as, as we all know, uh, in gate preparation. So, so basically, uh, the test series helped me a lot to increase my accuracy on the questions. So at this time, I remember in gate 2022, the paper was not that tough, but the concepts were very in-depth co concepts were asked. And I didn't get time to check, revise the questions. So the accuracy played a very vital role for me to get uh, this good rank this time. So a lot of questions and the question level of the test series were quite good, uh, equivalent to the gate that are asked in gate. So that helped me a lot in my preparation. Okay, Mr. Tiwari, see in our ES yes. test series, there are so many types of uh, tests are there, like a topic wise is there, yes. subject wise is there, and combination of two, three subjects. And also finally, yes. the full length of test, isn't it? Yes. So totally approximately how many tests you would have taken from ES test series? So this time around 100 again, because uh, practice test was also available this time. Yeah. So around 100 tests. Good. Very good. Very good. See, yes. I, seriously, from which month onwards you started taking this uh, test series? Sir, I started this from uh, uh, mid-August. Mid-August? Mid-August, yes. Sir. Okay, right. And generally students have one confusion, Mr. Tiwari, because yes. you are the... All India 7th ranker, I think you can throw some light on this uh, yes, doubt. Yes. What should you generally ask us is, uh, sir, when you have so many tests like uh, topic-wise, uh, subject-wise and full length yes, and all. Sir. So at what interval you have taken the test and uh, which one you have taken first, like, like topic-wise and then go for that subject-wise then go yes, for sir. like this. What is your, your suggestion in this regard for your juniors? So while you are uh, studying the new topics, you should always, when you complete your uh, the course of a particular subject, you should start giving topic wise test because that will help you to understand what type of questions are asked in gate. So that is very useful at that time. So giving topic wise test at the last time is not very useful. So you okay. should start from topic wise test, then evolve to subject wise test. And then finally, when your course is completed, then go for the full length test. So that okay. will give you a confidence uh, when your course will complete. So full length, you mean to say full length tests are more useful if you can attempt or probably in the months of December, January, like that yes, after sir. completion yes, of syllabus. Yes, sir, because if you are not able to score good, then your confidence will also go down that I am not able to perform good in tests, final tests. That is so true. That is true. Okay. Yes, uh, Mr. Tiwari, can you tell us something briefly about your educational background? Which college are you from? Sir, which year you have completed? Yes, sir, sir. sir, currently I am pursuing my bachelor's degree. I am a final year student at College of Technology, Pandagar. Govind Ballapant University. Govind Ballapant University of Agriculture and Technology, Pandagar, Uttarakhand. Uttarakhand. Okay, okay. Yes, Achha, you are a final student now. Yes, sir, final student. Oh, that is something special, Mr. Tiwari. You you deserve to be uh, what you call uh, congratulated and a different uh, mode altogether. Yes, final thank student you, securing seventh rank means something very remarkable achievement. Yes, so thank you. Sir. Uh, then you must tell us, Tiwari. Uh, from which year onwards you started your preparation seriously on this gate examination? Yes, sir. So I started my preparation, sir, when the first time the pandemic started around uh, our first lockdown that was started. Around I was in my second, fourth semester. So okay. I didn't know at that time the third year was eligible because the third year were eligible, I guess, in 2021, starting from 2021. Yes, yes. So, sir, so in 20, uh, when the lockdown started, so I started to watch the NPTEL lectures and all that lectures, which are available free of cost, that are available in YouTube and all that. But the moment I found that third year was also eligible for giving gate, so I started my preparation according to gate examination. And that was from August, August to September 2020. Mm -hmm. And sir, I gave my 2021 uh, in my third year, gate 2021. And my course was not complete. It was around 70%. But uh, still, I was able to uh, get around 800 gate score and 580 all India rank in gate 2021. 
Oh, great, 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 Tiwari. Uh, so third year you got uh, seven hundred rank, right? Nearly. Five eighty, five hundred eighty. Sorry, sorry, five eighty rank in third year. Yes. Sir. And this uh, final year, wonderful, our India seventh rank. Yes. Sir. So you, sir. see, when you are studying that the B Tech third year, final year. Uh, you must be very yes, busy with your academic work. That too, you have to take uh, online classes because of this COVID conditions and all. Yes, sir. yes. So how could you cope up this? Uh, your university syllabus and the gate syllabus and the test series, all this, uh, it will be very hectic, isn't it? Yes, sir. I I, I think that in this, uh, generally people think that the gate is very much different from classroom courses. But I I don't feel the same way. I think that if you can hundred percent focus on your classwork also. In your uh, college programs, yes. then also your 90, 80% course can be completed of gate, and the 20% is something which you can explore by yourself. So I focus both. Uh, first of all, I focus both on my concepts, mm. and then when the concepts were clear, then I have gone for the previous years and questions and all that. Okay. So, okay. Yes. Okay, Tiwar. Then you tell us, sir. See, uh, yes, sir. daily, how many hours you used to spend uh, exclusively on the gate preparation and uh, exclusively on your university syllabus preparation? Sir, uh, I would say uh, totally. I would say eight, eight hours, six to eight hours daily. On overall, in that, in which uh, four to five hours I will give to gate examination according to gate examination, and three to four hours according to assignments and all that, in which I have to focus on my college studies. college education okay right right okay atiwari did you prepare any uh, short notes for each subject for your uh, yes, uh, revision sir. purpose etc yes sir so i prepared in gate 2021 also acha acha right you prepared last year itself uh, short yes, notes sir. for each subject yes, sir. yes sir. Uh, short notes means how short is it uh, approximately let us say per one subject how many pages you have made there sir uh, my around it was 6 uh, to 8 pages Sixty-eight pages per one subject. Yeah. Yes, sir. So depending on subject to subject for production, it takes uh, more, more pages. Yes, yes. yes. Because some the production is a very big subject. Yes, it may demand more pages, yes, right? Yes, sir. Yes. I think uh, Tiwari, uh, especially for students uh, like you who are pursuing third year and final year, those who want to appear yes, for sir. gate examination, if you prepare yes, this type of short notes, it will be very useful for them to revise, isn't it? Within yes, sir. Short yes, of sir. Time. So yes. can you please advise uh, to your juniors? some key points that they have to take in mind while preparing such a short notes do you suggest anything yes sir so short notes depend on person to person for yes. me my uh, i have spent a lot of time on my concepts so i didn't write each and every concept on my short notes but the formulas were very important so i have written each and each and every formulas in my short i have included that in my short notes and also some points where which i find myself weak in Like some equations, in, if I talk about fluid mechanics, then there are some equations like Navier-Stokes equations and all that. So that I included on my short notes. So whatever your weak points are there, you you must include that in your short notes. Yes, sir. It's not yes. specific that this topic should be included. It depends on person to person. What is yes, your yes. weak point? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. See the short notes of micro notes is always a student specific. Student yes. specific, right? So depending yes. upon their weak area and strength areas, yes, they have to prepare yes, short sir. notes. So whatever they feel, right? That is what they have to yes, incorporate. Sir. Yes. So that will be useful for them for the revision work. So I think yes. all the students who are watching this video, especially those are pursuing the third year or final year, they have to focus on the short notes, prepare accordingly. That will be very useful for their preparation, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Sir. Right. Very good. Ah, uh, one more Tiwari. Did you prepare the yes. entire syllabus? Otherwise, any topic that you have left over? Sir, in uh, in gate twenty twenty one. I didn't focus a lot in uh, production engineering. Okay, Only I have just uh, this year, sir, my course was hundred percent complete. So almost all subjects you have completed. Yes, almost yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, right. Okay, good. And what was your strategy just before one week uh, before the actual examination? Sir, at that time, because I, if you have given a lot of time in preparation, so the last one week doesn't matter that much. You should keep your mind relaxed. That is more important. Because if you start panicking in the last week, that get be very problematic for you. Mm -hmm. So for that reason, I didn't focus a lot in studying in the last week. Mm -hmm. I just uh, did a small revisions, like three to four hour revision, mm -hmm. and the rest of the rest of the day, I just look up what what problems I have marked in previous years and all that. Mm -hmm. I uh, took those questions and practiced. Yes. Around five to six to five to six hours I took in last week. 
yes so that is a, that is a good suggestion see to avoid a panicking in the last yes. one week of time better not to attempt those test series etc right yes yes so in case you get a low marks there you may get disappointed seeing this yes to avoid yes. panicking better to just revise uh, some concepts yes. and be cool like, isn't it uh, yes sir absolutely right that's fine so what was your strategy on the examination day within 3 hours of time 65 questions did you follow any specific order otherwise uh, anything that you planned well ahead of your actual sir, examination so i had planned that i would uh, attempt all the questions but this time the paper was uh, uh, i will say it was not it how it is, it was used to come the paper was very different this time so around 10 or 10 to 15 minutes my time was wasted on some questions and around 15 minutes i i, I haven't attempted any question so after that uh, in that panic i i have uh, i have panicked a lot at that time so what i thought that whatever question i will see and it will easy to do so i will attempt only those questions so at that uh, at, at that strategy i was able to complete the questions and around i had sir one hours left and i have attempt uh, attempted around 40 questions uh, and one hour was left and i have to attempt like 20 25 questions more so that gave me a positive uh, for attempting the question further okay you said that within the first 10 to 15 minutes of time you could not attempt any question isn't it yes sir yes sir. my uh, time was wasted there 15 minutes why why it happened can you elaborate a little bit so actually i was I, this was because i was expecting the question paper to be very easy i thought they studying the questions will be very easy but the okay. questions were jumbled so i thought their questions were a little bit tough i attempted those question at last and then it was easy to do at okay. last time okay so could you attempt all the questions within the available time yeah no sir i have attempted around 58 58 6, 6 to 58 questions but this time my accuracy was very good so i was able to uh, secure 81.6 number 81.6 marks yes on india seventh rank very wonderful yes. very wonderful very wonderful yes. uh, mm-hmm. and uh, tiwari uh, any special suggestions for the uh, students who are pursuing the third year final year and who want to crack this gate exam any specific uh, suggestion yes. regarding this type of students so i would say that uh, uh, if you are preparing for giving gate in your final year exam final year then you uh, you can start from third year onwards you you will have enough time to secure well, to get a good rank in gate examination and uh, generally people say that you have to study 12 to 14 hours so i don't find that uh, right i think that 6 to 8 hours consistently if you can study every day then that is more than enough to get a good marks in gate examination so you mean to say that uh, uh, third year beginning onwards you have to focus on the gate preparation yes sir so whenever your major subject starts mm. like fluid mechanics strength of materials so you can mm. start your preparation from that time onwards mm. right that is a, that is ideal time to start gate preparation yes sir absolutely good 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 so did you uh, like see uh, when you want to what you call uh, uh, prepare the university syllabus the gate syllabus of course the gate test series and all definitely it is a very tough task right preparing all yes. and to sitting at home mostly online yes. classes and all yes. in this uh, in this journey of a preparation uh, did you ever feel any sort of what you call pressure uh, something like that uh, yes sir absolutely If so, what, in, what, what you did to overcome the problem, sir? For uh, some sir, at those times, sir, while giving test series, it happens mostly when you are giving test series. You have given like one years to your studies, and still, if you are not able to get good marks in your test series, so it is very, uh, I will say, it you feel very bad about it mm-hmm. that you are even studying for one month and one year, one year, you are not able to get good marks in your test series. but what i will say to all those my juniors who are attempting for gate examination mm. is that getting good marks is something different and building your concept is something different so always focus on uh, getting your concepts better rather than get, scoring good marks in test series test series eventually after giving 20 20 30 test series test series or test papers you will be able to achieve those good marks so you should never panic on initial days of your test series yes yes so so concept building is very much important that is a good suggestion tiwari initially the students have to focus on the building that what you call concept the basic uh, subject concepts once yes. you have a strong foundation with your concepts 
then if you start attempting the test definitely will be able to perform well that boost confidence further yes 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 that is true right good good and uh, one more uh, mr pipin yes sir see uh, with this uh, seventh rank what yes, are you going to plan are you going to join any psu otherwise joining mtech in some premier iit so um, if i will go for the masters then i will surely go for the isc bangalore because i have a dream to go to an isc bangalore to do my masters and the second choice will be P- of course psus and masters from isc bangalore and then second choice will be and some like bark bark and drd are also very good so i will try for those psus right uh, uh, any more uh, one more last question tiwari is because yeah. in mechanical there are so many subjects are there right Uh, yes. We have some what you call easy and uh, ideal way of uh, preparation. Do you suggest yes. anything? Some sequence of uh, preparation of these subjects. Yes, sir. Any order? Any order subjects. that you want to recommend? Yes, sir. So you you should always start from the basic subjects. Like uh, by basics, I mean like fluid mechanics for mechanical engineering, uh, especially. Yes. You, you should always start from basic like fluid mechanics, basic thermodynamics, strength of materials, and when your foundation is uh, built up enough. then you should go for the applied subjects like if you have studied fluid mechanics and thermodynamics then you can go for the heat transfer because that will be very very easy to understand heat transfer if you know fluid mechanics and thermodynamics and same if you if you are if i say machine design then you are for you machine design will be very tough if you don't know strength of materials yes so you should always start from the basic subjects build your foundation basic. good and then go for the advanced subjects basically like engineering mechanics and then strength of materials yes. and yes. then machine design right Yes. that sequence so if you follow the sequence it will be easy for you to catch the yes. subject yes yes okay and one one more uh, tiwari uh, daily yes. you said that you used to prepare some number of hours isn't it uh, yes uh, did you spend all the uh, hours of time on only one subject otherwise a combination of two subjects used to prepare it daily uh, sir i would say in starting time i prepared two subject like fluid mechanics and thermodynamics together so half time fluid mechanics remaining half time thermodynamics yes sir Oh. in between how much gap that you used to give what you used to do in that gap to relax so i rather go for the sleep sleep i just to give your mind a break right right okay what was the role of this uh, previous uh, questions and uh, solutions in your uh, preparation it must so have yes, played a key role yes sir so previous year paper helps you a lot on understanding the type, what type of questions are asked in gate and sir and in my experience i have found that gate examination m- mostly focuses on the applied i mean the uh, the what you can say the practical questions application of concepts apply. application yes, of application concepts. of concepts yes right very good right so yes. advise the students also to follow to take some tips from mr bipin tiwari in their preparation and whatever he has suggested i think will be useful points so with these points and the future aspirants also will definitely be able to crack this uh, gate examination so thank you uh, thank you uh, thank you tiwari for sharing your valuable tips with our students and uh, you, i i wish you once again uh, uh, good luck on i mean once again i wish you good luck in all your future endeavors god thank bless you, you god bless you tiwari god bless you right thank you sir